Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Soul. Sorry for how I sound. I feel fine. I'm just like, I'm at the end of a cold or like three quarters of the way through a cold. You know how that is, the coughing, like all that stuff. <laughs> I feel great uh, besides that. So anyway, this is our daily message for June 10th, 2023. If you want to work with me, you can work with me two different ways. I have my live readings that I'm doing. Those are $130. Per 30 minutes, please be respectful of time. A lot of people come, they book 30 minutes, and then they have four questions. And then they spend the first 20 minutes talking, and then I just start getting into the message. And they have more questions. So please just, I, I put that out there because that's something that needs to be corrected. And <clears throat> you book the amount of time that is right for you. Or if you're going to get a half hour, you know. Just ask what we can cover in a half hour. You feel me? So again, you can email me at angelsouls444 at gmail.com to schedule that. Or if that's not within your budget, I do have my standard readings, which are a little bit more affordable. And again, those go in half hour increments. You book as much time as you want. No time commitment on your part. I just ask that you make sure you read and respect the terms and conditions. Terms and conditions include, there's a wait time. Okay, now I'm usually running ahead of that wait time because I try to be pretty efficient with them, but that's not a guarantee. I also have people going past all of that to my email address to email me to have me explain to them how the standard readings work when it's all explained right there on the website. Please do not keep reaching out asking where your reading is, okay? It holds everybody up, okay? So, <clears throat> and um, if you're somebody who doesn't like someone who sets boundaries, talk to me about that I guess I don't know leave it in the comments we can have a discussion because we're not playing those games anymore and you listening to this if you're sitting there going oh she shouldn't talk like oh uh. you can't be doing that either anymore we're not doing it we're not letting whiny people get away with their stuff anymore okay that doesn't mean you got to be mean but we're not bad people or sassy or feisty for setting boundaries. Okay. It's usually something that is referred towards women who set boundaries. Can we not? Thank you. Leave your comments down below. Again, I'm open to discussion. We have ancient wisdom, crystal ancient wisdom. Where, where's the ancient lady wisdom? Oh, Michelle, you're hating on men. No, no. <laughs> Lean into the wisdom. There are things that have been going on in this world with people, with societal narratives, societal expectations that we do not discuss because it's weird because it's like women tend to be <clears throat> masculine and feminines. We all have both within us and we both have potential for insight. But in our polarity consciousness, women tend to be very intuitive, insightful, in touch with emotions. And yet, even though they're the ones that will see that stuff, and could speak on it, we're the ones expected to sugarcoat it the most. <clears throat> and if we don't, we get all kinds of labels slapped on us. Or people move away from us like, oh, I can't be associated with that. Wake up. Okay. Wake up. If you want to argue, take it to your journal. I'm selling journals now. Shameless plug. Get a journal to talk about how much you hate what I have to say about this stuff. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> But <clears throat> don't be bringing any nonsense around here because if we're all going to be a part of change, we need to examine our judgments, okay? So we're going to leave it there. That's part of that ancient wisdom. Okay, we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love. <laughs> Take care. Bye-bye.